part two. Now the manipulated variable is a distance of 75 centimeters. So again, now I'm at a distance of 75 centimeters. So the light source is on. Stopwatch is going to run for one minute, and we're going to see how long this one spins. see if your hypothesis was correct or incorrect about changing the distance. That's 30 seconds. We're going to go again for one minute each time. The only manipulation or the only change that we're making to this lab is the distance. The first three we did at distance of 25. Now we're going to be doing a distance of 75. One minute, got the stopwatch running. You can see it's barely going, and I'll say it's done there. So 7.86 for trial one. Trial two. Thirty seconds. This one looks to be an easy one. I don't see it spinning right now. So when I shut it off, probably going to be zero. And time. So for that one, it was zero seconds. And the third trial, just to be accurate, we want to make sure that we do everything three times. I don't know why trial two it wasn't moving, but now trial one and three it is. Not saying it's going fast, but at least there's movement. Again, you can see it's moving, and we're at a distance of 75 centimeters. I don't know if you can read that or not. That's where we're at. Turn the light source off after one minute. The stopwatch, how long it spins for? Three, two, one. So you can see it spinning. And done. 10.16 that time.